the VS Code hint, tip, and trick of the week uh, is one of my favorites, and I'm surprised we didn't have it before because I feel like I talk about this all the time. It is multiple cursor case preserve. So I love multiple cursors. That's the idea where it, when you select some text and you hit, like, it's Command D for me. I don't know what, I think it's Control D on Windows and Linux. It'll just keep selecting those words, and then you can type and change all of them at once. Well, one of the issues is uh, it selects ignoring case, but I don't want it to ignore case when I'm typing, right? Like if I'm changing a variable that's lowercase, but a component name that's capital or title case, I want those to all preserve. Well, that's what this this does for you. So you can select all of them, just yeah. type as normal, and if it was capital, it will keep it capital. It'll keep the case that you had, which is beautiful. That's pretty nice. Yeah, and it is Control D on, on Windows. So... Uh, that is multiple cursor, case preserve, literally nothing you have to uh, configure. You just install it, and it works. Trademark. It just works. <laughs> that was our VS Code, hint, tip, and trick of the week. Brought to you by Modernize and Die Podcast, CFML News Edition. Proudly sponsored by Order Solutions. You can see the new episodes every week on cfmlnews.modernizerdie.io or on the Order Solutions YouTube channel.